Refugees are ordinary people who live through extraordinary times. In the country they live in, conflict or persecution have put them at risk. They have no other choice but to flee and to leave their country to seek safety. This means leaving a lot behind, one of the hardest decisions a person can ever take. So what makes a person a refugee? Refugees are no longer in their own country and have crossed at least one border. Ongoing conflict may put them at risk if they return. Or they are at risk of persecution because of their nationality, race or sexual orientation. Or because they associate with a religion, a social group or a political opinion. Some get jailed or harmed physically or mentally. Refugees often flee with no more than the clothes on their back and leave behind their everyday life. They may lose their home, their savings, their career, and often their family and loved ones. The journey to safety can be long and full of dangers. During the journey, people can get hurt, and sadly, many lose their lives. All of this can cause severe trauma. Fortunately, there are international laws to protect refugees. Refugees cannot be sent back to their countries if it puts them at risk. Countries have a legal obligation to let refugees in and protect them. But even in a safe country, life as a refugee can be daunting. Refugees may continue to deal with trauma. Some are separated from their family and long to reunite with loved ones. There may be challenges related to adapting to a new environment. Host countries can provide assistance to learn the language and to adapt to cultural and other differences. But when does someone stop being a refugee? Some refugees can return home if the situation in their country becomes safe enough. Others will remain and integrate in their host countries. With the right support, refugees can successfully integrate and make a new life for themselves. Some refugees eventually even become citizens of their host country. Mm -hmm.